I am here at Bardo Cafe in Venice, which is right next to Exhale Yoga. And um, I am trying out a little dish that the owner prepared for me. And uh, I'm excited to try it out. I'm sorry if the camera's a little shaky. I didn't bring my tripod or a friend today. So basically, their, their menu is going to kind of change. They call this a gypsy cafe. So just like the gypsy way of life, their food is going to kind of change and be modified. So right now, they have an Indian menu. And I'm going to try a little sample of uh, the dal shana Shana I'm going to try a little sample of the dal, shana masala, korma, and eggplant, and some of the salad which has um, walnuts and raisins in it. And uh, I'm going to enjoy that with a cup of their mint mate. So let me start with the eggplant. It has a lot of ginger in it. It's really good, very refreshing. It's just the right temperature too. And the korma, really good flavors. They're very unique Indian flavors. Um, not, it doesn't taste like other Indian food that I've had, which I like. It's very subtle, it's not too spicy. It's very fresh, um, and it's just absolutely delicious. And the Shana Masala. I like how each of these different dishes here have a different taste to them, of course. The doll here. It's a little sweet. I, I think I taste cinnamon in that. Really good. Everything's great. Great temperature, not too hot. Just a nice, mellow, delicious flavor. And um, it's great. I this place just has a great energy to it, and so does the food. So you feel good as you're eating it. And let me try the salad as well. Salad's really good. Very fresh. A little sweet. Um, I think it has a vinaigrette on it. And then you've got the crunch of the walnuts and the raisins in there. So um, it's delicious, this whole meal. It feels like a home-cooked meal. I like about this place. I, I don't feel like I'm going to a restaurant. I feel like I'm almost going to someone's house. The energy in here, great staff. Everyone's really friendly, very loving, very positive. This would definitely be a great place to come after yoga. Um, and that's why it's great that it's right next to Exhale, right down the street from Yoga Works. There are a ton of yoga studios nearby, so you should definitely make this your destination after your yoga class. And uh, I look forward to coming here again and trying some more of their foods when their menu changes. Oh, and I should mention earlier, I got to try some of their raw ice cream, which was fabulous. They make it themselves. Absolutely delicious. Then I tried a mango lassi that was raw and made with macadamia nuts. Oh, that was so, so good. It's very hard to find a vegan lassi in general, so I was really excited to try that. As my final treat before I leave Vardo Cafe, I am trying the pina colada smoothie. And is this completely raw? Yes. Yes. Even better. Completely raw. Wow. Mmm. It gets better as it swallow it. Wow. Now what is it in this again? Coconut water, pineapple, agave, mint, vanilla, lime, and sea salt. That's fantastic. Really refreshing. It's got a great consistency, very smooth, just the right amount of sweet. A lot of different flavors. And the coconut you can taste. I love it. It's it it tastes raw, but it doesn't taste raw at the same time. It's just so sweet and delicious that it, it just tastes wonderful, very blissful. Mm. It's a perfect ending. <laughs> My full name is Eva Nueve Gitana Carpentier Castrobot. <laughs> wow, that's quite a name. It's a long name, but I go by Eva. Kastrabad. This is my cafe, myself and my husband, Farzad. We have been open three and a half weeks. I never owned a restaurant before. We wanted to bring our taste to the public and we wanted to serve. That was the concept, is to have a place that we would love to go to that's aesthetically pleasing, as just pleasing in all the six senses. It's a six sensual experience. It's all vegetarian and we have vegan choices and raw choices. The gypsy theme, or the gypsy spirit rather, uh, came from just my husband and, and I's love for the gypsy energy and philosophy of 
movement, constant movement and diversity, fluidity, flexibility and uh, adaptability. Being able to adapt in different situations and being able to embrace where you're at right now. That's the concept and um, a lot of our menu is going to be what we call family style. It's like when you go home to mom's house, you sit down and you eat and you eat what you're served. The lifestyle, in my opinion, has to do with travel, community, food, sex and music. Sounds like fun. <laughs> uh, being in touch with your surroundings, nature. You know, the gypsies know how to take care of themselves. They know how to live off the land. They take really good care of their animals. They are well versed in uh, herbal remedies. Living fully, uh, they seem very sensual to me, uh, which I enjoy. And I mean sensual in like the senses. Taste, touch, sound, smell, and the things that are unseen. Music is very, very big here. Uh, we have guitars. We don't have Wi-Fi, but uh, my husband and I say, but we have a guitar. So <laughs> put down your computer, talk to the person next to you, pick up the guitar, and let's talk. Let's have a conversation. Vardo means the living wagon, which is a gypsy word for the caravan. My tagline <laughs> for the food is that Again, you get exactly what you need, and it's comforting, it's warmth. You know, I wanted to call one of our dishes just Eastern warmth, and that's what is today. Yeah. It's just the warmth. Organic as best as we can get it. Natural, you know, we don't use refined sugars, we use agave, uh, we use some honey, uh, but we communicate with people so that they know what we're gonna be using. Um, we use high-end energetic food, energetic products. Um, so you're gonna have a uh, mango lassi that's killer, but it's all made with raw organic ingredients. And we have a lot of raw smoothies, so um, you're gonna get a healthy, energetic meal. We are open every day except Monday from nine to 10. And Monday we are open until Four. And then we close down and we're going to have community events happening on Mondays. We invite people to come by and, and take part in the cafe. It's a, it is a community effort. We're giving to the community, we're open to the community. You know, it's a, it's a dance, so we're not all in charge. We're here to, to welcome you and to learn from you and hopefully give you whatever we have to teach.